Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. Today we are back in the French Riviera in Cap Tip. I hope I said it right. And we're going to be showing you an exclusive home thanks to Night Frank, Cannes. And yeah guys, detour drone shots, let's go. All right, smash that like button if you enjoyed the drone shots. And of course, a big thank you to Knight Frank for allowing us to tour this beauty of a home. All the contact details are in the description box. Now let's talk about this long drive-in that we have leading you to the majestic home. You might have seen our car parked in that little niche, which also serves as extra parking for your guests. Now, where is the garage? Now we're talking about an expensive home. You'd say there needs to be a garage. Well, you are right. The unobvious, I'm standing right above a lift that drags down and allows you to park luxuriously underground in your private six to seven, maybe even eight car garage. And it's really cool. Now let's walk into the main entry of the house and show you what this baby has. Landscaped gardens, 3,300 square meters of plot. That's what we have, manicured, mature, Everything you need is here in the garden and I'm loving it because it's a nice contrast with the stable and stealth home that we've got going on here. And that would be the main entry into the house, the backside garden, we'll explore that later as well. Let's enter right now. We are immediately greeted with a designer kitchen. I have not seen a kitchen like this in our entire history of our YouTube channel because of the two islands that we have that are basically a broken up circle, one serving as your cooking stove, the other one as a two sink vanity island. Really cool because we'll be cooking here, cleaning there, it's a dynamic kitchen. What you'll also notice a lot of ceiling coves in a circular shape, which is disruptive to the clean architectural lines of the exterior of the house. And everything you need is in this kitchen. Appliances are found on this entire wall side. We have Foster appliances, wine fridge, numerous fridges to be quite frank, a lot of natural light coming in, a perfect kitchen. Patrick, what do you think? Thanks to the window, you also know when your guests arrive. Correct, super light lit. You can also slide them completely open to enjoy the breeze. Perfect. Now from here, adjacent, we have the dining table. Let's give it a quick glance. What's really cool about the dining table, not only that it's made out of this natural stone, which I fell in love with, it's beautiful, maybe a little detail shot for you guys as well to see what I'm talking about, is the ceiling cove and the chandelier dangling right underneath it, giving you that flotation feel. And of course, this stone that I just mentioned, which I fell in love with, also plays along the entire house. We'll get to experience that later. And access point out to your outdoor dining as well. Nice pergola, covered shade, everything you need is here. And following from there, maybe a quick shout out to the toilet, guest toilet, which is that door and a office here. Give it some detail shots. Nicely positioned so that you can work right in the heart of the house. This would be your formal living room area in all its glory. You have a different play of ceiling height here. This one, a double, once again with chandeliers, creating this dynamic sense of captivity here. A lot of windows bringing natural light in. And yeah, a very luminous, spacious living room. Access point also out to the amazing garden. Inside, I did not mention it yet, we have 550 square meters built and I think entirely built around just under 800. 
Perfect. Staircase leading up to four bedrooms. Let's have a quick look. Vamos. This floor houses four ensuite bedrooms. Let's have a look at them together. Vamos, bedroom number one, bedroom number two. And lastly, bedroom number three, right over here. Let's go. All en suite, as you have seen, very close by to the main bedroom. A fantastic setup if you have younger kids as well. Now let's look at the main bedroom together. Come on. Right, let's start off with the walk-in closet. There are two of them. We're going to be showing you one. Let's go. Walk-in closet, a lot of covered space. Slide open, LED popping up with sensors. Perfect for him and her. Every space you need to store your goods. You also have a walk-in a walk-in, a ensuite bathroom. Let's have a quick look. Two sink vanity, big bathtub, nice natural stone layout as well. And a mosaic on the walls. Perfect, everything you need. Now this is also the walk-in closet, number two that I mentioned, and off to the bed area. What's fantastic about this one is that you have free window fronts bringing luminosity in and also giving you that beautiful view out to the manicured garden. And just below there is also an outdoor kitchen, pizza oven, pergola style thing. We'll come to that. So yeah. And again, the circular ceiling cove with LED strips. A lot of these circular ones which disrupt with the more cleaner lines of the architecture. Picture window, another picture window there bringing the view in from out. Cool. Now it's basement time. Let's have a quick look together. Like the staircase with this brushed steel look, everything in this house is very clean and that's something that I personally like very much. Now let's have a look at the basement. Now in the basement we have two further bedrooms. Now behind me is the entry to the garage. We'll come to that in a second and also a laundry room. We'll also come to that in a second. Bedroom number one in the basement. Let's have a look. Perfect. Bedroom number one and bedroom number two share one bathroom, which is this one. Let's have a quick look. Voila, everything you need is here to sink vanity, shower, a stupendo. Now, big fan of what we are about to see next, which is the cinema. But before we do, bedroom number two. And now the cinema room. Let's check it out together. Perfectly sound isolated TV room cozy carpet on the floor nice padding on the walls here as well everything you need in the cinema is right here and also the star ceiling which shimmers really nice little detail here cool perfect let's continue to the little games room slash wine cellar slash gym let's have a look now that's a combo in this room fitness play area and also a really cool wine cellar that I'm going to be showing you once Patrick turns the camera on because it is really elegant and probably the most attractive part of this section in my opinion. A lot of choices, third income doors, refrigerated as well to keep it nice and cool. And I must Super. say it's the first uh, fridges I've seen which are fully but I mean fully, fully decked stopped. out. I love that. They didn't go for cheap selections either. I did spot some super good wines here. And, and cognac. I see, I see yeah. a very nice cognac. Cognacs up there. also. Top shelf. No, it no, goes here. Champagne is here, rose, uh, brut, champagne, and. Ah, but cognac, rest. man. Hard liquor. Hard it's liquor, a... indeed. What about the fish tank? Do what about the fish it? tank? It's pretty cool because the fish tank merges with the, the swimming pool. Yeah, but the picture window of the swimming pool. So what we see as a natural light comes from the swimming pool light, which is fantastic. And I don't know how they did that, but great job making this the vocal point of the entire area. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. We still have the garage. The garage so let's have a quick look together. The owner is a little bit of a car collector. We'll get to see that in the garage, but before we do laundry kitchenette, let's look. Everything you need, you have the entire server room here, the uh, dishwashers, that's because the dishwashers, laundry, everything, even a little stove to cook on, oven, fridge, sink, perfect. This is like your second kitchen, but underground. Now it's time for the garage. Let's have a look. <laughs> 
All right, this is a proper garage in all its meaning. Not only does it house one, two, three, four, five, six, seven cars, it's also a sort of mechanical room here where they come and restore the cars, like this one here. Very. Maybe, I think it's less a restoring more than, you know, like a fun time how to put a car together. Yeah, but I think they might also be restoring it. They've taken it fully apart, but it's also a mechanical garage, which is really cool. Lot of space. And now if you turn the camera, we are going to point out the elevator that lifts up to the ground floor where I was standing before, which is right here. We also have a turntable so that, you know, coming in and out and turning your car is so much easier. And this would be the lift that takes you up and down. Cool. We will show it now in the dealer shot. Yes. All right, you've seen that? Now let's look at the garden one more time. Come on. All right, that was basically 550 square meters that we have just toured together. Qualities are throughout, it's super elegant as you have seen. Now it's time to check out the outdoors area. Let's go. Now big outdoor chill out areas. This is the dining table I mentioned just before. We also have shades that roll out. Big chill area here, 400 meters from the beach. You can smell the ocean, which is fantastic. There we also have the pergola with the outdoor kitchen area. Let's have a quick look at it together because there's nothing better than cooking in summer outdoors. And I have one of the most fanciest pizza ovens I have ever seen. Right here, Alpha Living pizza oven. Super cool barbecue setup right here. You also have a fridge to store your ice. Everything you need is here to get your party started. And what you also get to see is the view outwards to the swimming pool area, to the heated swimming pool, just to mention that. And yeah, another one of these super cool pergolas that we've already seen once in our property tours, which is the Lamborghini of pergolas. Pergolas? Lamborghini of Hammocks. Hammocks. I was saying pergolas, you're not even correcting me. I was always wondering, I, I thought you were talking about these pergolas there. I was, I was. These pergolas are amazing. They open up fully. You can also shift the directions and do whatever you want. The hammock here is the Lamborghini. No, actually, if that's the Lamborghini, this is the Ferrari of hammocks right there. Heated swimming pool, really nice and long. And of course, the entire architectural structure of this house, which is also very impressive. So ladies and gentlemen, big thanks to Knight Frank in Cannes for allowing us to tour the listing. It's currently on the market. All the contact details are in the description box. If you like today's video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel. We're currently ending our tour in the French Riviera, but we are gonna be back in September to show you even more. Now it's time to walk down to the beach 400 meters and enjoy a beautiful meal, maybe some fish, right in front of the sea. Ah, can't wait. Patrick, last words? It has been, it has been hot. I don't know if you guys see it, but I'm dripping sweat. So it yep. is a tough, tough job to be a cameraman. 100%. Dominic is nice and dry, look at him. We changed his shirt just three or four times today. <laughs> but I, I stay in the same one. <laughs> so, all right, guys. Peace. Ciao. Ciao.